Hello guys, this is Saad and welcome to my channel. In this video I'll be telling you how to fix Realtek HD audio missing in the Windows 11. So let's begin the tutorial. So first of all what you can try is that you have to just go to your search, type in device manager over here, click on the first option. And over here you'll have to click on the small drop down arrow beside sound video and game controllers and you'll see your devices sound devices over here as you can see the real tech high definition audio which is for me it is over here you can just right click on it and then you'll have to click on properties over here you'll have to click on the driver option over here and then click on update driver so first of all you can just search automatically for drivers on your PC and as you can see it's already installed the best drivers are already installed so you can just close and then you can just click on the second option over here browse my computer for drivers and then you can click on let me pick from a list and then you can see the Realtek high definition audio is showing over here and now you have to select the Realtek and then click on next and this should fix your issue but if it still didn't fix your issue i'll be showing you some other ways that i hope can help you to fix this problem so this may take some time and finally it has told me that my drivers have been updated now you can close this and you may have to restart your pc and it's better to restart your pc from just the start menu you can click on restart so after restarting a PC or laptop if your problem isn't solved what you can do is that you can just go to a browser I'll just go to Microsoft Edge now over here you'll have to type in the brand or the company of your laptop and then type in the audio driver in front of it so for example I have an Acer laptop and so you may have a Dell or a Lenovo doesn't really matter you can just type in your Lenovo or Dell over here type in audio driver and hit enter on your keyboard now it can also be HP so you can just type in HP audio driver and hit enter now you'll see their official website and just go to their website over here you'll have to just type in the model number of your device now I'll be telling you a very easy way to find the model number of your laptop so what you can do is that you can just go to your search type in cmd click on the first option command prompt over here you'll have to just type in this command which is wmic space bio space get serial number and then hit enter on your keyboard so you can just select all of your serial number you can click on Control C on your keyboard and then you can paste it over here by clicking Control V. So now you'll have to click on Find from here. And as you can see, you can select your operating system from here, but Windows 11 is not over here, it does, it's not updated yet. But Windows 10 should work as it will download the latest version of your audio driver which is the real tech you can see the real tech written over here you can just click on download from here so if for you it's not acer i'll tell you on how to download for your laptop or your pc so for you if it's dell laptop you can just type in dell audio drivers and then you can just go to drivers and download on the first option you can just go to command prompt type in your id search and then repeat the same procedure from similar to what we did over here and if you have a lenovo or an hp laptop or an pc you can just type in hp or lenovo repeat the same procedures so as you can see our file has been downloaded so now you can just click on open file audio so now you'll have to click on this audio realtek 6.0 the only option over there and now you'll have to scroll down until you find this option which says setup.exe and it is an application so you'll have to just run it and it may take about 10 seconds or 20 seconds to actually process 
so now you can click on finish after rebooting your PC or you starting a PC or laptop you'll see the Realtek high definition audio driver setup will automatically turn on, on by itself and now you'll have to click on next and the new software with the latest version is now downloading you'll have to be patient that it, as it can take some time so now it is almost done and I hope this would fix your problem So the installation process has now finished and now you'll have to choose whether you have to restart your computer now or later but I prefer you to restart it now. You can save any of your work which is now open before it restarts your computer so you'll have to click on the first option and then click on finish to restart your PC or laptop. So after you restart your PC or your laptop you'll see that you can just type in in your search device manager and then I'll show you the version of your Realtek HD audio that it has been updated to the latest version. You can just click on sound video and game controllers and under that the Realtek high definition audio then right click click on properties click on driver and you'll see the latest version over here which is 2018 and for some people it could be 2020 but for the Acer which is my laptop the latest which was the 2018 one so I downloaded that one but for some other brands which is Dell or HP it could be 2020 so now for my according to my laptop this is the latest version which is 2018 so now I'll be showing you another way which could help you to solve this issue so now you'll have to go to your source type in control panel click on the first option and you'll have to now over here click on uninstall a program now you'll have to click on view installed updates so over here you'll see the updates which have been installed on your laptop or your PC so what you can do is that you can uninstall any specific update after which your audio stopped working so this would help you to remove that update and then your audio may again start working you can just figure out which update may have been the reason for your audio not to be working you can also see the date of the installation on the right over here which is 714 for me and the other updates on the bottom over here and you can just click on the update and then you can click on uninstall to uninstall the update and now you how you can check if your real tech is working or not what you can do is on your bottom right you'll see this sound icon you can just right click on it click on sound settings and then you'll see this that your speakers are now selected and which is using the Realtek high definition audio so you'll have to make sure this is selected and as you can see it is using the correct audio and now you'll have to scroll down click on more sound settings and you'll see over here that your speakers are using the Realtek high definition audio and it is set as the default device so everything is working now and i hope this video would have helped you for more similar videos like this you can subscribe we'll meet in the next video till then peace out